Hello all! Today I'm going to teach you how to determine the atomic weight of an element. The numbers you come up with won't be exactly per perfect since I'm teaching you a shortcut, but don't worry about it because that's all they want you to do when you're doing a school assignment. So the first thing is obviously to get the element. I chose silicon because it's pretty simple. Then I did a Google search by the name of the element. So I'd look up silicon. I clicked on the Wikipedia article. I know, I know, it's so unreliable, just bear with me for a second. And scroll to the bottom of the sidebar to the section called Most Stable Isotopes. Now you should see a little table. This table shows the most stable isotopes of silicon. The NA section is where the percentage of the kind of isotope is. The ISO area is where the mass number is shown next to the chemical symbol little bit of info. The net mass number is the number of protons added to the number of neutrons that are in the nucleus of an element. All you need to do is take the mass number of an isotope and multiply it by the percentage. For the percentage, you move the decimal to the front of the number. Don't forget to do that. And then, y once you have done this with all the isotopes, you add them together and you'll have your weighted average. A weighted average is the average of the isotopes since if you're like me and just doing this for school I'm pretty sure you don't want to go through all probably a hundred something isotopes Yeah, that's how you do an isotope. I hope you learned something, and thanks for watching.